The drum beat signals the last moments of the fight. Gong Pry knows he's beat, but he keeps charging. It's not enough. After five devastating rounds, the fight is over. Gong Pry went the distance, but he lost by points. After the fight, Gong Pry apologized to me. He said, I'm sorry, mother, for disappointing you. I told him, it's okay. You are my son. You did well. Next time, we'll find a way. Exhausted, Gong Pry wants to be left alone. Meanwhile, in the back streets of Bangkok, fight night is starting all over again. As Sam Sheridan checks in for his first Muay Thai fight. After waiting five months for this fight, Sam finally gets a look at the competition. The situation is worse than they thought. The Osaka champion from Japan is at least 10 kilos heavier than Sam. He's also much older and far more experienced. Even more intimidating, he's covered in tattoos and missing the tip of his little finger. Two traits commonly associated with the Yakuza, the Japanese Mafia. Of course, it could be just a coincidence. The speculation alone is enough to rattle Sam's support team. Be a little bit worried about this fight, yeah, and actually worried for Sam. He can't break a bone or uh, get a head injury. Yeah. You should, should keep, keep, keep a toe on your hand if you should stand in the corner. Yeah. <laughs> he was in a fair setup. Uh, we thought it was a gentleman's uh, uh, agreement that it would be an uh, amateur initial fight for both. So it will be a uh, true test of uh, Sam's skill, what he has learned, which is a lot of experience. Uh, should anything happen, then we'll go in a towel. This is not the opponent Fairtex expected. But Happy Day is still on hand to give Sam whatever last-minute support he can. All too soon, it's time to step into the ring. Step by step, Sam performs the same Y crew that Happy Day did in the 60s, one of his own trainer. With Sam, the ritual has come full circle. The Japanese boxer skips the pre-fight rituals, opting instead to hang back and wait for Sam to finish. They start methodically enough, pacing themselves and testing each other's foot. The champ lands a good kick to Sam's side. Sam's taller and takes advantage of his height. The opponent keeps chopping away at his legs and targeting that same spot on Sam's side. The fight is barely underway when Sam makes a drastic error. 
Happy Day always warned him to keep his hands up, but out of habit, he let down his guard. It's a stinging introduction to his first fight. Suddenly, the karate champion begins to falter. The ring is slippery from all the sweat and oil. The Japanese fighter keeps losing his footing. Looks like the champ is already getting tired. After all the hype, seems that his glory days might be behind him. Trapped in a corner, Sam defends himself with a knee jab. Something the champ's karate background would have never prepared him for. In the first round, the fight goes to Sam. He's just won his first Muay Thai fight on a knockout. is over, the champ is still trying to breathe. Hey Blue, tell me the truth, is I getting my ass kicked? What? Is I getting my ass kicked? No, 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 it's okay. Okay. Well, I'm kind of excited. <laughs> well, it's, uh, I feel excited, so to say. But at first, when he knocked that Sam down, I was like, no, no, no. And, and uh, I said, come on Sam, get five sides. And, and Sam, he, he's still going, going. And, Punching, punching, reach, 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 knee, 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 and it's like a, it's like a adrenaline going on, you know? Great teacher. <laughs> Must do it now. Don't tell Bob to take a graduation. Yeah. Uh, it was a close thing. I feel like it was really close. But I was in better shape. That's all fair to That's all happy days. That's all happy days. Adrenaline is going down now. <laughs> yeah. Type of thing is excitement, you know. Cool. While Gong Pride's injuries heal, his mother won't let him train. Despite the latest setback, his future looks bright. He may not be a champion yet, but he's already a hero to his community. With her first win under her belt, Boontam has finally tasted the glory she's always yearned for. But it came at a high price. After the fight, she separated from her husband, choosing to stay at the gym. She eventually returned to her family, but she's still torn between two worlds, clinging to the hope that she can someday return to Bangkok and fight for a title. Sam's training with Apiday paid off beyond his wildest expectations. Whether or not he ever boxes again, he'll always remember that one night in Bangkok. No doubt next year's contenders will also come from the slums, the fields, and the most unlikely of places. And then these stories will repeat themselves as a new crop of fighters take their shot at becoming champions of Muay Thai.